Okay, today let's talk about interlibrary loan. That's this link you will see right here on the library website. And interlibrary loan is uh, you need an, a copy of an article or a chapter from a book that you can't find through our regular subscription databases and you can't find open access to online. So uh, we have subscriptions to a lot of journals and a lot of ebooks and things like that, but we don't have a subscription to everything and a lot of things you won't find open access to online. So when, when you have a situation like that, you could use interlibrary loan and uh, it's pretty easy. You just click this link. You should automatically be logged in if you're logged into your uh, CSU global account. So uh, it should take you right here. You can see it knows it's me and then I could just click create a request. This might come up automatically for you, but I'll just click create a request and then you would just type in whatever you're looking for. Now it's set by default to articles. So you here's the journal title, the date of publication, the volume number that it's in, the issue number, basically all of the and give us all the information that you can about it. And this will send out a request, say down here if you're staff or student or undergraduate, graduate, whatever you have there. And uh, then what will happen is you will be emailed a link to this article. It usually takes uh, three days, sometimes it takes five days, sometimes it takes a week. So the one thing to be aware of, you will not get these immediate, immediately. So there is no charge for this and it's a great service, but it will take time because this request then goes off to another library and it's up to that library, that other library that's not us, how quickly they fulfill the request. Uh, so it's it's something I would highly encourage you to find something you have direct access to through the library's databases, through one of these database links, or get in touch with us in the library and we can help you find something because this is a great service, but it's not going to be automatic. It, it will take a little while for you to get this. And uh, our turnaround times at CSU Global, as you know, is you have assignments due every week and it's due very quickly. So if you're ordering something for a final project, I think that's good. Just give yourself some time because it won't come automatically. So you can order articles, you can order in book chapters. Now, <clears throat> you, you cannot order in uh, chapters from your textbook. This isn't designed to get you around buying your, your textbook. That's, that's not what this is for and, and you can't do that. But but if you want a chapter from a book that you're using for your research for a paper, you could do that. Or like it's set up here articles. So it's that easy. Uh, and then you would get an email within a few days. Uh, I, I, I would plan, sometimes it comes within a day, but I would plan three to five days. And just be aware of that. And that's how you use the service. So get in touch with me if you have any questions about that. Thanks a lot for watching.